Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for, oh, the 17th, the 18th, the 19th, something like that. You know, the timing is fluid, so this is just a message that I'm picking up on for somebody in the near future. So, let's just see what we got. What do we have? Ace of Coins. Ace of, that's great. That's potential, solid, stable opportunity. Huge. That's a golden opportunity. That's a big buck, huh? It is a big buck. Um, this is a blessing. This is a gift. Somebody has manifested something. Somebody could be receiving something um, big. Now, the Ace of Pentacles is uh, could be long-term. This is long-term potential, something that could really last for a long time. Um, somebody has manifested something. Page of Swords reversed. Now, the Page of Swords reversed is an enemy being caught off guard. Nine of Coins. Now, typically the Page of Swords reversed is uh, bad news or a message that you don't want to hear. The Nine of Coins is somebody that is self-sufficient, stable, hard worker. This could be a child. This person is very uh, independent. very comfortable. We have somebody here that is very comfortable. We may have this very comfortable individual that is being watched. This person is watching this person. Somebody could be getting a gift, okay? Because I don't know if there's an inheritance coming in. This could be somebody who's upset. decision is being made about stability so we have a decision that is being made and this is about stability this person is very stable we have somebody here that is very very stable they're a hard worker of cups there could be some gossip going on there could be some gossip or there could be somebody that is overindulging they could be partying too much uh, socializing too much not working hard enough it feels like somebody else could be getting somebody else's opportunity it's like you snooze you lose or you don't put in enough effort or Somebody, it's it's like this, I'm going to give it to somebody else. I'm surprised we don't have the Six of Pentacles here. Somebody may be being stopped right in their tracks, okay, with the, with the chariot reversed. There's a lack of discipline. So there's a lack of direction. Somebody is very scattered. It's like they're socializing. They're not putting in effort. Maybe they need to stop talking so much because this is antisocial and this is too social. Now, this is coming out of hiding and socializing, so we could change this up. We could have somebody here that is uh, deciding to start dating and come out of hiding. They've been in exile. They've been lonely. This is, but this is, this is like uh, unable to master emotions. But this this is like this could be emotions all over the place. Uh, going through a new doorway, getting a golden opportunity. Somebody is headed in a new direction. They are. 
It may be deciding to stop something and go down a new path because they see a bigger, brighter opportunity, a huge opportunity. Moving. Somebody is moving. They're moving in a new direction. They are. They're leaving something troublesome behind. But there's this is like a social this is like there could be a social outburst or who knows what. I mean the chariot reversed is uh it could be an emotional outburst. Could also be something being stopped. Putting something to a stop. This is making a decision to stop something and move on. So somebody is making a decision to stop moving in that direction. Maybe they're making a decision to stop being lonely and they're going to start socializing. They're going to start dating. They're going to get on the dating sites or whatever. Or they socialize somewhere. They go out with their friends or something like that. This could go in many different directions. This is moving in a new direction. After being stopped, after being stagnant, somebody may have not been making any moves, but here they now they're ready. Something like that. This is this is moving to a better place. This is, but it looks like somebody is driving. Somebody is driving. Somebody is is taking somebody away. They're taking somebody away. They're taking them someplace else. I don't know if it's a child because we have a child here. So a child could be going someplace else. Now, this is the moment of decision. It's all about stability because this is all about stability. And this is, we, have, we have at least one person here that is very stable. Very stable, very solid, very secure, uh, very grounded, hard worker. This person has proven themselves. Well, this is like, this is like, uh, mm. Now this this page of swords. What is this page of swords reversed? What is this page of swords reversed? No success. It's a no. Whatever it is, it's a no. This page of swords is is conflict, difficulties, a liar. We could have somebody that doesn't tell the truth here that causes problems that speaks without thinking and, he, and it could be a child even but when you get to six of wands in reverse it's it's like losing it could be losing a child i'm sorry somebody could be losing a child now this or you know and and children it could be adult children <laughs> just keep that we are all somebody's child um, six of wands reversed. There's a setback of some sort. There's no victory. There's stubbornness. There's immature. Somebody is very immature, very childish. That could be childish. Therefore, there's no win here. A very childish individual, or it's a child. Ooh, the Empress reversed. Ah, come on now. Why? I don't. Don't do this to me. This is frick. That you know, I don't know what is going on, but somebody could definitely lose their child, and I am not gonna pretty that up. And I'm sorry. It is. I can't. <laughs> could be a mother could be, obviously the empress in, a, in the reverse is a mother that doesn't take very good care of her child okay she doesn't take care of herself she's selfish she doesn't nurture herself she doesn't nurture her children she is selfish she's self-centered she's high maintenance she's easy she's a whore she's uh all those bad things that a mother should not be, okay? So the Empress in Reversed um, really doesn't even, like, deserve to have children. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 
So I'm wondering if there is a mother that is losing her child. And I don't, it doesn't have to be a death. I don't see a death here. I, I don't. I see that there could be a child that is moving away. Okay? They're moving away. They're moving somewhere else. Or maybe they're being taken away. I don't know. I, I'm just being honest with you. We do have somebody here that is very solid, very stable, very grounded, very down to earth, very hardworking, that has proven themselves. This person, they have proven their stability. They have proven their uh, value. And it's easy to see that this person is hardworking. This hardworking individual is getting a gift. I mean, a child is a gift, okay? And that is a gift right there. It is. So it feels like we have somebody else that is getting a gift. There is a gift. And remember, I started this out with long-term stability. So a stable, permanent situation, permanency. So I feel like we, we have somebody here that it, the, the Empress is a loss, whether it's a child or a loss of a relationship. This is a, the Empress reverse is a loss. It's a, it's, it's a loss because there's a lack of growth. There's a lack of nurturing. There's a lack of unconditional love. There's a lack of love. Okay. The Empress is the goddess of love. There's a lack of love here. And therefore, it's time to go. The, the Six of Swords, it, and this is this could be in a relationship, okay? It doesn't have to be a child. But there's no victory, there's no success, there's no progress being made. You know, it's time to go. It's time to go. So there is somebody that is going someplace else. And they're, wherever they're headed, I think they're headed towards something permanent and solid and stable and secure. Um... You know, we could... Now, this is a horrendous loss. The Wheel of Fortune reverse is a horrendous loss. It is. And it's because of somebody's... Uh, well, the Wheel of Fortune is a card of karma as well. It could be bad karma. It could be from a past life. This is re repeating uh, negative, repetitive patterns. Past mistakes coming back to haunt you. So somebody's past mistakes may be coming back to, to haunt them. Um, and there, there could be a social outburst, not a social, but it, it, well, this is social and this is outburst, but it could be an emotional, emotional outburst, you know, that, and it could be social as well. So somebody may have an emotional outburst because of, you know, um, A loss. You know, I'm wondering, I mean, I mean, I'm not trying to scare anybody, but when you get the chair reversed, there even could be a car accident, and I'm not trying to scare anybody. And you got to think about drinking. It could be drinking and drinking and driving. So I'm not, I, I, I just have to tell you what I see that causes, you know, this is a wheel, and this is, there's wheels here, here, so, you know, just be careful. I mean, just be careful, I, you know. Anyhow, um, I feel like, um, Something is coming to a halt, okay? And I think there's been some sort of uh, situation where something was hidden, obviously, with the Hermit reversed. But now something is being shown. It's Now it's clear. That there's some sort of clarity here. Um, this, this, this could also be, if it's not the loss of a child, it could be a, a woman that doesn't know her value. She doesn't know her worth. She doesn't... Um, you know, she needs, she's needy. She's, she's very needy. Very, 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 very needy. Therefore, you know, she doesn't have find a successful partner because she needs anybody. Okay. So that could certainly be the case. This, this is Empress in reverse, maybe having a hard time finding a stable, solid relationship. She doesn't want to be alone and maybe she needs to be alone. This is an independent person who need, has, has, taken time to pick themselves up and build themselves up to stability and security. Now we have this independent person that is receiving a gift. I know that's what this independent person is receiving a gift. But this empress who isn't a very good mother, doesn't take care of herself and doesn't know her value is experiencing some sort of loss. She is. That opportunity is being given to somebody of value that knows their value and doesn't need somebody to complete them. Because the Nine of Pentacles is an independent person who doesn't need somebody to complete them. The Empress in reverse does. Doesn't know how to take care of herself at all. Very, I mean, this is your little whore, okay, that, it, you know, whatever. It is what it is, you know doesn't find anything successful because she doesn't even love herself. She, you know, if you can't love yourself like this person does, then don't expect somebody else to love you. You can't, you know, whatever. 
So um, we do have a big, huge loss because this person keeps repeating the same patterns. This person chases. Okay, this one does it. I'm fine by myself. I don't need anybody. And this is the one that everybody wants because very self-sufficient. Doesn't need to rely on another person. This person needs. Okay, I need to have somebody take care of me. Not this one. This one is going to receive something. Here it is. This person is giving it to this person. So we, yeah. But this is your chaser. Okay, the Empress in reverse is a woman that chases. She chases a man because, or the partner, because she doesn't know her value. But nobody sticks around because she doesn't know her value. She's easy. So we have this easy individual that it keeps repeating the same patterns over and over and over and over again. And therefore she doesn't find no success. She needs to go into hermit mode and know, learn her value and her self-worth and her self-confidence and experience the pain that she has been through and feel it and acknowledge it and deal with it and, and grow. This is, this is value right here. Know her value before she can receive something valuable. Until she does, she's just going to keep getting, repeating those negative patterns and going nowhere. She's not going to get anything successful. So anyway, um, I feel as though we have, right around the corner, we have this independent person that is going to be receiving something solid, stable, and secure. Um, and I think it's probably, I think it's probably, this person has just been enjoying life, you know, doing fine, I'm good, I don't need anybody. And I got it, here it is, you're the one that I want. They could, it's like this independent person may decide to get on social media, may decide to start dating, you know, because this is socializing, dating site, whatever, going out, whatever, coming out of hiding. It's like you come out of hiding and here comes an offer. So yeah, that's what I got. I feel like we have this we have this uh one person that is experiencing a horrendous loss and they may be they may have they may be very emotional over it. They're very emotional like why why why? Well, you're experiencing this experiencing this loss because you don't know your value. You 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 chase your you're needy, you're selfish, you're self-centered, you, you you can't take care of yourself, you know, who wants that? If you can't, don't expect another person to take care of you. If you can't take care of yourself, then... <laughs> you better find a way, okay? This is about take action. Take action. You are very capable of taking care of yourself. So anyway, we do have an independent person who is just <laughs> doing fine. That is about to receive some sort of gift that they have manifested through time. You know, they've been in hermit mode. This person has taken the time. The one that hasn't is going to experience loss. Good luck.